Hey there, I'm the Holder Fire Family, and welcome to the Narge and Reacts. In this, we're reacting to The Legend of Vox Machina, Season 1, Episode 11. So, without further ado, let's get right into it. Yeah, what what are, what are your two's plans here? The celestial alignment is almost complete. I'm so curious on what's with, what's with her, because she's obviously not a vampire or whatever he is, so... Or her husband is, so... It begins. But how is she not aged? I'm telling you, they're gonna sacrifice the sister, as well. Wait. Uh, he recognizes him. <gasps> we should focus on this book. He actually Some remembers. Kind of undead creature whose soul seeks the power to return to our plane. Oh. Uh, oh yeah, that's the thing that was whispering to the 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 wife or whatever. Yeah. So the whisper. I mean, of course he's gonna be using her. I mean, you you. Come on, some creepy ass voice that goes, Come here. Like, you really think it has any good intention and it just wants to help you out the goodness of its heart? <laughs> help him. I don't give a shit what they're doing. They, I don't think I they even realize. Once he returns, you and I will be together forever. That's because he's going to kill you and both and then you will eternally be stuck together. Against what we have built. Uh huh. Oh my god, that just turns me on. Ugh. <laughs> no. Uh-uh. <laughs> so don't don't make love right here right now, please and thanks. Grog, I want him alive. Oh, uh, <laughs> Sorry, I forgot. Not Cassandra. No, she will answer to me. Then I got bro the husband. I never get to play. What about the Buddies, husband? We still need somebody to handle Silas. Mm hmm Any suggestions? Um me? I don't know. come with me. Our minds. Come with me and you'll be in a world of pure imagination. <laughs> You're not leaving. Or no, in a world of pure eternal damnation. <laughs> there you go, that's more fitting. Uh, you're... You're having a hard time controlling it, aren't you? Oh, that's, that's not good. Don't care. Yeah, you made a deal with something that's uh Cassandra. Yes, mother. He needs to feed. Oh, he's fed on her before. Silas! We have debts to settle. Uh this why you refused to die. I kinda assumed we were gonna sneak up on him, but okay. I'm just walking right up to them, I guess. I don't think they care about running. Who's running? Uh-huh. <sighs> Bye, Brock. <laughs> oh, are you two gonna fight? Love on the battlefield. Oh, never mind. Well, I mean, sis brother, sisterly love. Uh, sibling love. Are you sure it's gonna hold him? Yeah, this guy's that strong. This guy is strong. You need Grog to handle him. Oh, okay. Okay, don't one-on-one -on -one this guy. You need multiple of you. Grog needs the help. Oh, at least he got a wound on him. Oh. <laughs> she muted him. She muted him. She's trying to go for the, I think, neck hit that knocks you out. He's in there, just under control still. You got the two sibling, pairs of siblings fighting each other. Can you get out of my ear, Cassandra? He was young. Sure, whatever you say, Cassandra. They took me in when you left me to die. They were you were little. You abandoned me, but the whispered one won't. We are his blood, and his return will Yeah, his blood, because you're he's literally gonna consume your blood and become one with him. When you're trying to play a game on when it's muted. <laughs> 
Where's Grog? We all prefer you this way. Get away from my gnome! <laughs> Get away from my gnome! Oh, okay. I thought there was a thing between the two of them. The freaking the dice room, not the dice. The freaking okay. Probably a good thing I can't hear you right now. Yeah, probably is a good thing. Gala, now's not the time to hug her. You, you don't pull that when you're trying to kill him too, girly. <laughs> that's not that's not fair. Wait, the flash. I'm telling you, she's under control too. He gave her his breath. They're in, like young, probably early teens. There is work to be done. I knew he was controlling. I knew I Oh, Grog is out. Kayla, do something. No pressure. I... <sighs> She's gonna connect to the tree. The roots are the tree above. Yeah. Is she gonna let it feed off of her energy or lighter life or something? Oh, the music. Tree? Oh, is it gonna imbue her with powers? <clears throat> this music, though. I like this music. I like this music for this scene. Almost the matter can't handle the light. Okay, okay, okay. Va Vex, Vex. I love. I I know. I can feel it. My face believes you. And the light's gonna make her stronger. My turn. Come on, Scanlan. Oh, yeah, he's still muted. Oh, are you gonna get blasted away? Oh, thank God, that's over. Just sing. I'll take care of this, darling. Uh oh. Um. Um. Is he, um. 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 Somebody. Incoming. Oh. Grog. Uh, don't try and seduce me. Seduce. I mean, he's not wrong. Ooh. He's not wrong. Wow, he almost cleaved you in half. <laughs> Real men hug. Real men hug. I like the music here. Are you taking all of life? God dang, Keyleth! Whoa. Okay, this is now my favorite scene and shot in the whole series so far. How do you like being muted? <laughs> Barbecue vampire. Holy! Okay, he's dead, for sure. Now she's free. That kill was mine. Well, you should have killed him faster then. Oh, she's in. Yeah, now you got her. She's gonna be pissed. I've got you, brother. She has nothing left to lose now. Ew. 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 Okay. Somebody needs to like crash this party. Honor our bargain. I mean, it did bring him back, but uh. It's gonna suck all your blood. What's happening in there? Shut up and let me work. Are you really trying to lockpick it right now? Percy's starting to smoke a little. Wow. Okay. Percy, you're running into what I don't think you understand. That's not gonna be enough. You're a uh, 
Huck above. All for love, huh? Is your arrow going to pierce? That pierces, but the bullets and stuff don't. Uh, Keyleth? This. Oh, you're gonna regret this. All that thing is. You promised. This can't be all there is. Oh well, he got his kill. She's still alive, but barely. I need to do this quickly before. Oh, of course, of course, of course. And Kiryos will be too if we don't do something fast. I mean, that's the only way to heal her, right? Well! <laughs> What's an ending to an episode? What the f- Wow. Okay. Huh. Okay, I don't, I don't, I don't think there's gonna be much more to the credit series there. Holy! All right, let me, let me get into my thoughts. Okay. All righty then. Holy moly! Oh, what an episode! Huh. Oh, okay. Huh. Oh, overall. Great. Uh, you know, I'm skipping right ahead. <laughs> that, that just slowed me up. Yeah. The freaking. Uh, okay. So Silas died. Um, which is fine because he was bad guy, didn't like him. Um, but now you got this whispered one that's now unleashed, and Keyless is on the verge of dying. Uh, Pike has been lost her connection, so the one person I think that could heal Keyleth is gone. So, uh, wow, what a what a cliffhanger! Keyleth is almost dead. Whispered one's unleashed. So what's he gonna do? Yeah. Oh my. <laughs> and that that music. Anyway, I, I, I could get into that over each one, so yeah. Alright, so the plot for this episode, definitely everything... Uh, I think this is the second to last episode for this season, yeah, um, definitely, uh... Uh, pretty serious, uh... Pretty, uh... Pretty big, a pretty big episode in the sense of stuff happening. Um... But yeah, the plot was great, characters were great, um... But I love how the Silas really got it. taste the taste instead of taste the rainbow mother trucker it was taste the sun, <laughs> taste that vitamin D. Um, but yeah, now uh, what's her name? Uh, oh my god, I forgot her name. Um, this is Zula's voice actress's character. Uh, she's dead now. I'm guessing, yeah, because she's been shot. Um, and, and also Percy is also losing more and more control over that whatever he's made a deal with to take out the Briarwoods and stuff. So. Yeah, I wonder if his sister's name is still on there, even though she's now not bad. Um, so uh, that'll be interesting to see. Animation, definitely, I would say the best animation of the series so far was in this episode, especially the whole animation sequence of like Keyleth with the tree and like that was gorgeous, and the music too. Like, oh, I want to look up the music for that specific like that whole sequence because that was really nice. Uh, really, really cool. I love the choir and just like. Yeah, it, it felt, helped it feel really grand for an episode. Um, but yeah, overall, that actually, honestly, might be my favorite episode of the series so far. <laughs> it's, it's overall, it was really good. Um, but yeah, uh, great episode. Curious to see what's going to happen in the next one, which I believe is the season finale. So yeah, I wonder if they're going to... I can't see them unleashing this... Whispered one just to wrap it up in an episode the next episode uh, I feel like it's gonna have to lead off to season two where this thing escapes or survives and then they have to take care of it and It builds power or whatever. It's gonna become like a big baddie uh, For the next season and I, I believe they've also greenlit They've not greenlit, but there's also gonna be a third season of the legend of Vox Machina. So 
Who knows? Maybe it'll be interesting to see. I feel like this should be a big baddie, though. That's going to continue on, not just be for this season. And that's in just I mean, like just for two episodes to be gone um, that or they seem to destroy him. But he actually survives and then comes back later on or something. I don't know. Uh, but anyway, those are my thoughts for this episode. I hope you enjoy this reaction. Have a wonderful morning after night and keep bringing bright. See ya.